Okay, Aries, what's going on with y'all? Can y'all hear me? Let me make sure you can hear me. All right, Aries, um, you have your commitment is being tested right now. I definitely see you involved with someone who you are just not sure about. You're always in your mind about this person. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I see Scorpio. I see Pisces. I see a another air sign. I see Libra, actually, a Libra that's telling you to end this situation with a Libra. Do not pay attention to this Libra. Nothing's going to come out of this situation. This person hasn't changed. Don't do it, okay? Very controlling. Like he has so many options, whoever this Libra is. Also, I see Leo's Aries, Sag, that there could be. It's like a new Aries coming into you guys like Aries. I don't know who this person is, but it could be a female who do you find who you find attractive. Um, I see you always want to touch this female. You just want to touch her. You want to give her some a commitment, a real commitment. But be careful because Aries women, you could really become this person's op, one of his options, or Aries men, you could be this woman's one of her options. Okay, um, just don't try to force anything. That's what I'm saying. Don't force it. Some of you guys, um, you're very close to achieving your goal. This full moon, I want you guys to manifest. We just got out of Aries full moon, so hopefully you guys wrote down your manifestations. Right now, I see you guys being very overwhelmed when it comes to like schoolwork, work. You're trying to manifest a, um, a win, and what it's telling you is slow down. Take your time, okay? It's coming. Don't worry. You're doing everything the way you're supposed to. It's going to get there. You should see a big change within six months. Don't worry, it's coming. Just don't come, don't get stagnant, don't get stuck. If you need to take a break, like I tell everyone, it's okay to take a day, don't take a month, okay? Put your emotions into it, put all that you have into your work, whatever project it is that you're working towards, and you're definitely going to see a great outcome, all right? Back to the love situation, I definitely see someone spying on you. I definitely, I see some, uh, Libra, it's something about a Libra from the past that's spying on you, Aries. This man could have been very controlling, but I feel like you brought this person fulfillment. I want, I don't think you trust this Libra though, and I'm going to be honest, you shouldn't. You shouldn't. This person could very well be in a relationship with a Pisces woman or another water sign. This Libra could be with definitely a water sign. That he has control over. This person is very quiet, timid. She's nothing like your energy. Nothing like your energy. Whoever this new woman is, she's nothing like your energy. You guys could have been like a power couple type thing. This person could miss the sex with you and not wanting to admit to themselves that they much rather prefer to be with you, Aries, than this new person. Okay, I think at one point I'm getting I'm getting Gemini. I don't see Gemini, but I don't know why I'm getting Gemini. The Gemini could have very well been attracted to this water sign over you in the past, but what I'm seeing is things change now. And they feel stupid. Whoever this air sign is. Your advice is to let go of the situation. You have better things coming in the future towards you. I see you having a new water sign. I see a Virgo, water sign, Pisces Cancer Scorpio, a new yeah, this person from your past completely tore you apart. Completely tore you apart. Yeah. You had to do a lot of self-reflection, a lot of shadow work to heal from that. This person 